what is smart about the bicycle? Well, if we look at the current approach towards cities, I think it's quite intriguing um, that we're constantly looking at evaluating these kind of systems, which I think obviously don't work. Um, it's about incrementally changing these kind of systems by implementing more uh, cars in a clever way, by um, decreasing the, the space between cars, by adding 5G, by talking about um, whatever. But in the end, I think it's really simple um, because we already have the solution right at hand. Because I think the solution is focusing on people and actually focusing on people. So what do people uh, love to be? Where do people love to be? And I think it's in this kind of places where uh, you can see each other, where you can talk with each other, uh, where you can simply cross the street, where you can have a conversation, sit on a terrace. So instead of focusing on technology as a solution, we should t focus on people as a solution and uh, focus on what people actually want. Well, and as you can see, it's quite a pleasant place to be, but at the same time, we're constantly focusing on uh, 5G, how that would solve the issues. But I think if we really look at, at the best way to approach this, um, we should focus on the bicycle as a solution. We recently were joined a trade mission to South Korea, and there the, one of the high delegates of, uh, of the, the government of uh, Korea asked as well, what is clever about the bicycle? And I think it's solving so many of the issues of social equity, of uh, efficiency, of safety, of economy. Uh, economy. Um, it's, it's touching upon so many topics, but by having high city officials not recognizing this as the, the core of the solution, I think that's really the essence of the problem here. So what I'm here for is I want to open up a conversation with all of you to see why we're not recognizing this as part of the solution. Um, why we're always seeing cycling as uh, the closing piece rather than the starting piece um, and, and how we can improve this uh, over the next time.